Hi and welcome to another how-to video. Whoops, let me get that. Okay, I'm back. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a backup of your hard drive with the Chronos True Image software. It's very easy. I'll help you explore some of the options and explain them to you so you can understand, you know, the capabilities of the software. And let's get started. Okay, step one, fire up the software by clicking on a shortcut. Click on Disk and Partition Backup. Select the source drive. I'm selecting the one terabyte hard drive where I save my data, like movie files. My destination drive is already set to my two terabyte Western Digital Green, but you may have to choose whatever drive makes sense for you. Okay, let's check out the schedule system. So click on turn on, and as you can see, you have daily options, weekly options, monthly options upon a certain event. Um, you have advanced settings. So you could have a run at system startup. You could have a set of delay after startup. Um, you have all these different options you could set, but we're not going to set a schedule, so we're going to hit do not schedule. Okay, now let's uh, explore the backup schemes. Okay, right now set to incremental. Okay, so let's see what other options are available. We have full. A full backup version stores entirely the data selected to backup. Okay, a differential backup version stores the changes that have occurred since the last full backup. Okay. And finally, an incremental backup version stores the changes that have occurred since the last version backup. For the purposes of this video, we are going to do an incremental backup. And since we have not made any backups of this drive yet, it is going to do a full backup. Okay, so hit backup now and the process will start. And for this drive, it actually took about an hour and a half, I believe. Okay, I'm going to use some movie magic and speed through this process. Okay, the backup has finally completed. I'm going to close this window and I'm going to open up a Windows Explorer window. Okay, so I click on computer, I go to my Z drive, I'm going to rename this drive, so I'm going to right click, click on rename, I'm going to call it backup drive, because that's where I put all my backup files. I'm clicking on a backup folder, and now that's the backup archive, go inside of it, okay, go further in. Just going to grab a random file just to show you that you could pull anything out out of the archive um, if you need to. So I'm just grab a text file here, okay, for CPU Z. I'm gonna copy that and just paste it to my desktop. And I'm just gonna open it just to show you. So you can make a backup, you could go easily into the backup archive, pull out what you need if you know you need to check something out. Okay, that's it. This program is really easy to use and I hope you subscribe to my channel so you could be informed of more great how-to videos.